Okay, now it's your turn to practice. Okay, given this formula here, make x the subject. Okay, um, x is here. Um, yeah, so press pause and have a go. Make x the subject. Press pause. Okay, um, to, to do this, visualize it as, um, as, as one bubble here, multiplying it to the top. Because w when you have something times in a fraction, it gets multiplied to the top. So, so inside your mind, visualize it as this, uh, y equals bubble over, over 6. Okay, that, that's inside your mind, because it's getting multiplied to the top. So now you are here, times both sides by 6. Okay, so it would be this, this, and then root uh, 3x over 5 pi a squared. Okay, so, so, so basically, now you, you've got a bubble inside here. Okay, now square, square both sides. So it would be, uh, square means times by itself. So 6y times by itself. So 6 times of the 6, which is uh, 36. And the y, the y times the y, which is uh, y squared. Okay, and on, on this side, you, you're just going to be left with that bubble. Okay, 5, uh, sorry, 5, um, 5 pi a squared. Okay, so now visualize it as this, one bubble dividing by this bubble. Who cares if this, com uh, this, this bubble here is complicated? Just multiply, uh, just multiply that bubble to both sides. So this would be, well, we, remember, we, we are, we are multiplying this to both sides. So it would be 36y squared times 5 pi a squared. Well, number times the number first. So what's 36 times 5? Um, well, 5 times 6 is 30, carry the 3. Uh, 3 times 5, 15. Uh, we carry the 3 earlier, so that would be 18. So, um, so it would be 180, okay, number, number here, times with this number here, would be 180. Y times, Y squared times with the Y, well, there's no Y on this side here, so it's just going to be Y squared. And then, pi times with the, well, no pi over here, so it's just going to be pi in here. Um, and, uh, and, and A squared, well, the A times with the A over here, well, there's no A over here. So it's just going to be a squared. Uh, and then on, on this side it will be 3x. If you don't understand this, uh, watch one of the earlier videos on, on, on Liger or Ligers, I can't remember. Um, uh, yeah, watch, watch one of the uh, early, earlier videos. Um, and, 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 then, um, and then remember, we, we want to get x on its own. So divide both sides by, um, uh, by, by, by 3. So take the whole thing down, which is 180 y squared pi a squared, and then divide the whole thing by 3. And then here you've got x all on its own. So you've just made x the subject. Okay? Alright, this one here. Uh, hang on. This one here. Um, so now you've, again, visualize, visualize it as, uh, as this thing here. And then multiplying to the top. So, so earlier, you, you, this, earlier the top number was 1. So, so when, when you have something like this, 1, uh, over, let's say 4, well, w when you multiply this to the top, because, because this number is 1, you, you, you're just going to get a bubble over 4. Okay? But now you've got a 3. So, you, so you, 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 you will have this, whether 3 over 4, uh, bubble to the top. So you will actually have, uh, 3 bubble, over four. So get rid of the four first, and then, and then get rid of the three after it, it, in the next step. Okay? Well, anyway, do what you have to do. Uh, make, um, make X the subject. Okay? X is on, on top here. So, uh, press pause and have a go. Okay. I'm, I'm going to visualize this as, well, o over here somewhere, vi visualize it as, well, as this. Three, uh, bubble, over four. So, so times both sides by, by four. Okay, so you have this. Um, times both sides by four. You have four y, and then you have three, uh, root, root five x over six 
pi to the power of 4. Okay? And now, and now visualize this as, uh, as this thing here, multiplying this thing here. So kill of the 3, divide both sides by, by 3. So it will be uh, 4y over 3. And then you've got this thing left. 5x, uh, 6 pi to the power of 4. Okay? Now, uh, square both sides. So square, find a blank space somewhere. Uh, time, squaring it means times by, by itself. So, uh, fraction times fraction. So it's top times top, which is 16, uh, y squared. So, uh, so 16 y squared. Uh, and then re remember, we are here, we are squaring both sides. So at the moment, I am squaring this. Okay. Um, so bottom times bottom, which is 9. Okay, uh, and, and on this side it would be 5x over 6 pi to the power of 4. Okay, so when you are here, you, you, you remember, you, you, you're keeping an eye on x. So, so you're trying to kill off things surrounding the x. So at the moment we're, we're killing, we're killing uh, the, the square root sign by, by squaring both sides. That would take us to this. Okay, and now visualize as this. You've got one bubble. Dividing another bubble. So let's, let's kill off the, the bottom bubble. Because keep an eye on x. Because that's what, that's what we're trying to make the subject, x. So, so times both sides by 6 pi to the power of 4. So here, remember, so, so here, some, somewhere here, you've got this. Uh, y to the power of that, and that. Well, well, when you times both sides by, by, uh, by this bubble here, by basically, remember, we are, on the left hand side, we're going to have this multiplying to the top. Okay? So, so, well, anyway, we are multiplying both sides by the bottom bubble. So it would be, um, um, it would be this thing here multiplying to the top. So, hang on, we will have six, uh, six pi to the power of four in here. So, um, so, so this six here will get multiplied with a sixteen. Hang on. Uh, so, so sixteen times times 6 will be, well, 6 times 6 is 36, carry the 3, uh, 6, 1 times 6 will be 6, uh, with the 3 earlier, 90, 96. Um, yeah, so, so, so this, hang on, uh, sorry about this, uh, not 90, so it would be 96, um, y squared pi to the power of 4, okay, over 9, and this side will be this. This is supposed to be a five, okay? So, so basically, we are multiplying both sides by this bubble here. It would give us this, okay? Uh, and now, um, uh, and, and now divide both sides by by five. So, so on the left hand side, if you divide some, if if you have a fraction, you divide by five, it gets multiplied to the bottom, but the top stays the same. So it would be this. Hang on, ninety six y squared pi to the power of 4 and remember the 5 gets multiplied to the bottom so it will be four, 9 times 5 will be 45 um, and this will be x so so it will be this okay the um the the the, the important parts here is, is when when you're here visualize as this 3 um 3 and then sorry 3 uh 3 over 4 times a bubble here, this complicated bubble. So that, this is the important part. It gets multiplied to the top. So it would be a y3 uh, bubble, bubble over, over 4. And then, and then times both sides by 4, and then divide both sides by 3, and then deal with the bubble. Okay? That, that's, that's the important part. Okay?